Hello everyone, this is Wireless Packet. Today I uh, surfed over to Bawana.tv and I uh, was watching his uh, video blog post and he had a blog posting on there about how to install open source applications onto your iPhone with uh, an application from Null River uh, called uh, installer.app. Now you uh, download the installer.app application which is free, um, launch it in OS X uh, the application will sync the installer application onto your iPhone. Um, you launch the application. Basically what it does is it uh, pulls down a list of available packages from a repository on the web using your Wi-Fi connection uh, if available on the phone. Uh, if not, it uses your edge connection. Um, what you do is you scroll through the, the available packages, click on the package you wish to install, click install and that's it. it. It installs the uh, the application. There is no hacking. There is no opening the terminal and, and inputting command lines and, and having your cable hooked up to your phone. It, it, it just works. It, it's very simple. Um, I'd like to you know, mention to you, if you haven't noticed already, that uh, my wallpaper is showing now through uh, by my icons here. And that's uh, that happens when you install an application you know, from uh, the available list of packages. Uh, there's also an app here called Xlaunch. When you install the launcher, you'll have your launcher uh, app button right here. I changed that with another application, and I just put my Xlaunch app here. Xlaunch, basically, it's just a, a menu that allows you to scroll through the available applications on the phone. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on Xlaunch, launch this app, and uh, just show you some of the applications that are on the phone. Uh, Apollo IM right here is uh, an AOL instant messaging client, which works nice. I was using that earlier. A few of these apps I haven't used yet. Uh, as you could probably see, there are a lot of familiar applications on the phone already um, by default listed here. Um, mobile Twitterific, which is amazing. If you Twitter, you want to use Mobile Twitterific. I'll show you that last. I'll, I'll launch that application. Uh, there's an NES emulator for those who are nostalgic about running their Nintendo games. Um, there's an RSS reader, send file utility, which allows you to send any file on the iPhone via email. Uh, there's a terminal app, text editor, uh, voice recorder with uh, V notes, which allows you to record your, your voice notes, which should have been on the phone to begin with. Uh, iFlashcards iLauncher, which is another launching uh, utility. There's iLight, which turns your LCD display into a uh, like a little flashlight. It just brightens up the backlit and makes it white, so you could uh, use it at night if you need to. Um, iPong, which is Pong, but it's multiplayer, and you could play uh, against other uh, people who have the apps installed on their iPhone over the web. Uh, IRCM, which is an IRC client, I was using that using that earlier on the Wild Right server in the Chris Perillo chat room. Um, mobile Twitterific. I'm going to launch this app right now and just show you the beautiful UI that this app has. Now you could follow all of your Twittering pals with this app. It shows their, their Twitter icon and it uses the uh, scrolling technology of the iPhone beautifully. Now with this app you can uh, reply to friends with private messaging. You can update your you know, your Twitter or um, wherever you are. You just Twitter from this instead of sending SMS's. And uh, it's just a, a better way in my opinion of, of Twittering. I mean once uh, once the Twitter fanatics out there see this app available for their iPhone, they're going to want it. You know, they're going to want to download this app and use it. So uh, that's that. Um, I hope uh, a lot of you iPhone owners out there who see this video uh, don't get afraid to do this. This is really simple. I highly recommend it. And if you, uh, you have any questions about this at all, uh, please feel free to email me at uh, wirelesspacket at gmail.com. Thank you very much for watching.